Hello, happy Sunday everyone, it's Pirate. I want to come on and just chit chat about some new equipment I got. But before we do that, I wanted to come on and dedicate this video to um, a wonderful man in the VC by the name of Steve Carlson who unfortunately went through some real tough times um, recently. Uh, you know, he basically lost his entire music collection and I'm not gonna go into it too much. There are other people who better explain what's going on, but you know, uh, my heart goes out to you, Steve, and I'm gonna dedicate this video to you, but um, love your content, love your positivity, and you know, it's, it's so horrible to, to see what's going on. There, you know, there's a GoFundMe page that's out there right now. I'm going to leave that in the description along with Steve's channel. Uh, you do not have to contribute. Um, it's not my GoFundMe, but I wanted to spread the word. Go give his channel a watch. Go give his channel a like. Um, subscribe to him. Anything to get through this tough time. We're all going through tough times right now, to be honest. But he's, he's having a real tough time right now. So I want to take a little bit of time before we got into things to just chit-chat about... Um, you know what's going on what's on my mind and yeah so this video goes out to you steve from love here in virginia all the way to you this video goes out uh, to you i want to apologize for my hair i just got done doing some stuff outside and while i still had light out i wanted to film a video but we are going to be talking about some brand new equipment that i got but before i do i wanted to show a couple of things uh what i one record i've been listening to my plan is to show one record i've been listening to before i get into the video proper but i also wanted to show off that I have uh, completed something kind of cool. So one of my favorite movies is Tombstone, and I was really excited when the Funkos were announced, uh, especially for Doc Holliday. I think I talked about it in a video before, but I did get one of the Doc Holliday pops. I was like, okay, so I knew there were at least two more out there, but I was at least happy to have this one. This one is the one, uh, just the general one where he has a shotgun. But, uh, you know, I China, I'm not a pop channel, but I wanted to just talk about it. But I did snag the Target exclusive as well, you know, with this little cup. And I got the one that I mainly wanted, which is the Walmart two gun exclusive. So I have all of my Doc Holidays. I'm very happy about that. Now I just need the rest of the Tombstone um, group, but I have it very happy about that. And I wanted to pop on and talk about this record right here. This is the National Boxer Live in Brussels. This was a Record Store Day exclusive piece on clear wax. But this one goes for stupid money. And I listened to it recently. It's pretty good. You know, I'm not the hugest National fan, but I was uh, excited to hear it. it. It needs a clean. I actually have a full, I actually have a full stack of records to clean probably when uh, this video gets uploaded, and I apologize for the shaking, that uh, that's gonna get cleaned. So now let's chit chat about what I really wanted to talk about. This video is not sponsored. I Everything I'm saying right now is my own thoughts, but I did grab a new set of speakers. They are the Klipsch R41 passive speakers. I got them for my stereo. My stereo's not in this room right now. It's actually in the room where I'm working so I can listen to some music while I work. Uh, it's been hit or miss whether I could do that recently, but um, I'm hoping to get to listening to more, especially because these speakers are, well, let me get back to you on that. I'm going to cut to what you're going to see in the box here in just a moment, so you get an idea what's in there, and then I'm going to come back. All right. Here is speaker box it is pretty dang large I'll give you an idea here what's going on inside but let's go ahead up here and I apologize this is the first big unboxing I've done on this channel so let me go ahead and grab what I need see if I can easily navigate and show you what's in the box here this is the Klishp, again, Klishp reference R41M speakers. Let me see, okay. I can move this out of the way. And then we can take a look at what's kind of on the inside, so. 
Turn you here. So this comes with some uh, instructions. I'll be reading that in a little bit. Oh, aren't these beautiful? Take a look at one of the speakers. Hopefully, this is in shots. But the best part is the unboxing. So we can just get an idea what it looks like. And I do know that the covers magnetic so you can get an idea what that looks like so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut off here get these set up and we will do wrap up well, that's in the box uh, I wanted to do one video where I showed an unboxing gave it a little bit of time and then came back well life got crazy like I said in my last video so I'm trying to get back to doing one a week <laughs> So um, I, it has been a little bit of time since I did listen to those, and they're wonderful speakers. I'll be honest, they're really good. I got them at a good price, and um, got stands for them, some good wires so I can properly distance them, and it's breathed new life into my setup. I've listened to more records now than I have in a while, and I'm really happy about that. So my next step is to upgrade the turntable and then get a rack for everything so that I can configure this room to be much easier and much nicer to listen to things in. So, R41 speakers, I got them for 175, I wanna say. At the time, they're 219 now. So, they're still relatively a decent price for the pair, but I got, my, I got mine at a good price, and I cannot be happier with them. They sound amazing. Um, it's, like I said, it's bringing new life into my music, so. Uh, not too much downside, to be honest. I haven't had them long enough to have any downsides, but my first impressions are these are really good speakers. Um, I know Klisp is one of those names that goes around in the VC and just um, music community in general. So they are very good speakers. I can recommend them. Um, they are a little pricey, like I said, but if you're looking towards that next step up from just your uh, record, you know, your turntable and powered speakers, they are a good way to go. Definitely worth the investment uh, if you're going to be paying just a little bit for them. There's not much difference between the 4.1 and the 5.1 from what I've seen. You can look up technical specs if you want. But they are really good speakers and I can highly recommend them. Thank you so much for watching. Again, this video goes out to the wonderful Steve Carlson. I'm thinking about you and I'm thinking about everybody in the VC. I don't comment that much, uh, but I do watch the videos. I do enjoy them. And, um, yeah, life's been crazy. Uh, I think we just need to kind of be a little more close and connected and together. So wanted to give, again, a shout-out to Steve and everybody who's watching. Um, you know, I always say at the, the end of everything I do, when life gets rough, keep on going. I don't want to use my last sentence because of what has been going on but when life throws you a curve please keep going even if you feel like no one believes in you i believe in you there are people out there that are rooting for you and want the best in you you know life throws you a whole lot of craziness and you're definitely not alone in that you might think you're alone but you're not alone i'm rooting for you and i hope for the best and until next video i hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and also, this is being put hopefully up on the Sunday that I'm filming this. Uh, thank you if you are a veteran. This is Memorial Day. And I just want to say thankful to you. Thankful to everybody who's in the active military. You guys are a lot to this country. You know, you, you sacrifice your lives and do a lot for us. And for that, I am very thankful. And with that, thanks for watching and take care.